Welcome back into the 215. We're still, of course, hanging out at Longwood Gardens here. But I think you know by now, after a couple months of watching this show, that Mike, Jarek, and I will eat almost anything. But, uh, pig's blood? Yeah. Mike actually just found a restaurant on East Pass Yunk Avenue that does gourmet things from snout to tail. It's called Ember and Ash. Well, this should be the culinary experience. I'm in South Philly, in between, well, Tasker and Dickinson on East Pashunk. And you can't get much hotter than that when it comes to eating out and food and restaurants. And look who I'm with. Hi, Chef. I do. Scott right. is also the owner here, Ember and Ash. Why'd you call it that? Uh, it kind of represents a part of part of the life cycle of, of the fire itself. We have a yeah, I see it back there. An eight foot wood burning uh, hearth that we cook, you know, pretty much the entire menu. Yeah. Over. No, this is what I heard about the place. That, like you said, you eat the entire animal from I've heard it nose to tail. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you're talking about like internal organs too? Yeah. yeah. Well, give me an example. What do you say? Uh, veal kidneys or something that we don't shy away from. Livers on the menu right now. Um, I, at times, when we can get a hold of lungs, lungs or something lungs like that, that people don't often think of. The lung like, of what? Uh, of lambs. Really, really delicious when it's treated properly. Okay. What is this massive thing in front of me? Here? This is a beef shin. So, a leg of the cattle. How do I attack it? I see the lead. Just like, uh, like, kind of build your own lettuce cups. Grab a piece of bib, shred some beef into it, a little bit of jalapeno and some pickles, and oh my you god, get to go. it's, it's yeah. so. Look at this. You get a piece of tendon in there. I got a tendon. Yeah. It's so, it just falls off. And then you make a little sandwich out yeah, of it. A little lettuce cup. Like that. Put a little jalapeno and some, and some uh, pickle in there and you're good to go. How many people would that serve? About four to six. If it's four people and this is kind of their only entree and they're getting a couple sides. Oh, there's uh, some lemongrass in here, a little bit of dried shrimp, uh, some uh, kefir lime leaves. It's all in there? Yeah, everything in the braise. And then we make a curry paste that we uh, as we reduce some of that liquid down, we kind of glaze over the, the beef. <laughs> okay, so you eat the marrow right out of the bone. Yeah, give it back. Is that Scoot prepared? Yeah, go ahead. Now see, I'm, I'm a fan of But the, what in the heck is that? Is that like a pig's toe or something? Yeah, pig's blood can only. Are you serious? Yeah, we use a little bit of blood in the shell in place of some of the yolk. Is it going to taste like blood? No. Sure. Would you like me to eat one with you? Yes. Well, you, apparently, you'll eat anything. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> this is fantastic. Thank you. But if you're also feeling adventurous, remember they are on East Pass Yonk Avenue. Go check them out. We'll be right back after this short break.